Well, here we are at Dunsmuir Airport, uh, elevation uh, 3,500 feet. Uh, we're right next to uh, Big Mountain, about 10 miles away from us here. We're going to put five video cameras on and rock and roll before thermal start building. Well, the plan was to drop into Dunsmuir Airport, a few miles from Mount Shasta and about 162 nautical miles from our home base at about 0730. Uh, Drop-in is the operable description here since Dunsmuir pretty much sits in a bowl surrounded by mountains. Um, I was also a bit high on my approach, thus necessitating the side slip to landing that you see. My friend Jan Wells was along for the ride and to operate the cameras. Jan's an A&P, an IA, and one of the best airplane mechanics I know. He's also a ferry pilot, so he can take the controls if hypoxia should make me too stupid to fly the airplane. Also, after just doing all those major repairs to the airplane's fuel tank, it felt good to know I had a good mechanic right at my side. Anyway, we got the cameras on, had a bite to eat and something to drink, then turned and burned for the big mountain. It was a race against time and the rising sun. The later we were getting up there, the greater the likelihood of, of getting our butts kicked by turbulence or mountain waves. Normally, I like to be done and heading back down the hill from these high mountain sites by about 9 a.m. We were definitely going to be pushing that limit. But luckily, I had picked the absolute perfect day for this flight. It was starting to look like we might even be able to fly all the way to the top of the big mountain, 14,179 foot, and the fifth tallest peak in California. Uh, basically, we're uh, right over the Mount Shasta ski area right now. Uh, which had no snow this year, so it did not operate. Uh, let's do a figure eight and just keep going up. We can always make the hard turn and go down the hill. Okay, we're climbing to 9,400. What a beautiful day. You see any climbers? Uh-uh. Or Bigfoot tracks? Yeah, she doesn't want to climb too good at uh, 9,500. Well, we're still still pulling off about 400 feet a minute, though. 70 knots. We got a, a south wind here pushing us. We got about... Yeah, yeah. Don't yeah. go to the other side. Yep, we'll... Uh, I'll go out, make a loop up, and we'll go back. Wow. I'm gonna send these pictures to my Swedish girlfriend. We climbed this together. Oh, cool. Yeah. Where were you when the uh, Air Force jet buzzed you? Up here somewhere. Up here. <clears throat> and then the, the jet was like way down there. Still climbing about 400. Okay, at with pass 11, 60. Up oh, this high peak up there, directly to the fr turn left a little bit, 10 degrees. Yep, we were up here. Yep, we were up here. Yep, remember. You went to the top of that? Yeah, just like right there. Cool. I didn't go up any higher though, because I became chicken shit. It's another 2,000 foot up to the top, though. There may be somebody over there. Just fly the plane, I'll look. Uh, yeah, there's somebody up, up there. You see somebody? Yeah. Just one person? Two. Two people. 
climbers. Yeah. Right there. Ninety nine o'clock. Okay. Two people. Well, they probably uh, have our end number by now. Okay, twelve thousand. We'll call it a day. Okay. Yep. All right. Let's call up uh, home and head this baby a hundred and seventy nautical miles for our home. <coughs> uh, probably have enough fuel. We might make it. Pretty damn good if we do. Bom, 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 bom.